hey, guess what? Now you can create Instagram Reels ads using Facebook Ads Manager. Yes, that's totally possible. That's one more placement for us. It used to be Facebook desktop, news, uh, news feed on mobile, then Instagram Explorer stories, and now we can put our ads on Instagram Reels feed. And there's a lot of people, a lot of eyeballs there. So before we jump into it, and I'll show you all the steps, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell icon, and also like this video. Okay, now let's jump right into this. Uh, I'm gonna go to my Facebook Ads Manager. Here's one of the ad accounts that I manage. Uh, and then let's create a brand new campaign. And let's call it, uh, let's say I wanna, objective could be anything, whatever you wanna achieve, traffic, uh, engagement, video views. So for the purpose of this video, I'll just pick video views. Uh, and then hit continue. And when you do continue, it creates the whole structure for your Facebook ad. Um, it creates the campaign and then the ad set and then the, uh, the actual ad. So in the campaign, I'm just gonna call it test IG reels. Scroll down, everything looks good. Then I'm gonna hit next. So ad set is where you select different placements. So what are placement? Placement means where you want to show your ad. Do you wanna show your ad on mobile or desktop? Do you wanna show your ad on Instagram, um, mobile app or Facebook, right? So that's where you select all of your uh, placements. And the Instagram Reels placements is is in there. It's kind of hidden, I'll show you in a second. Uh, your daily budget could be you know whatever you wanna set it to. So I'm gonna skip that for now. Uh, audience, make sure you select the right audience. A lot of people make this mistake of picking random audience or cold audience. So whatever ad you wanna run, ask yourself, who's the right person for this ad? And then select that here. Uh, if you have custom audience or any audience saved, uh, you can uh, do that. For example, for this, for this account, this client, we've done some research and here are the top zip codes. We know their buyers come from these zip codes, so we have saved these zip codes in a saved audience, so we use this a lot for the campaigns. All right, let's go uh, to the placement. So this is where the magic happens. So instead of automatic placement, what you wanna do is, let's say if your goal is to run uh, ad only on Instagram Reels, you wanna select manual placement. And then we're gonna deselect Facebook audience and then uh, Messenger. So now we only have Instagram selected. If you scroll down, uh, look at this. So Instagram feed, Instagram explore, and boom, here is the brand new uh, placement Instagram reels, right? Uh, and then uh, if you wanted, uh, you could Seems like you <laughs> to run ads on Reels, you also have to have Instagram Stories selected. Um, so you can run your ad on both uh, Stories and Reels. Now here's the uh, requirement, right? So if you wanna run your ad on Instagram Reels, what they recommend is full screen vertical video, right? So the mobile phone dimension nine by 16 in 30 seconds or less. So that's extremely important. Now, one thing I'll mention when you create ads for your Instagram Reels or you know, TikTok has this saying that make TikToks, not ads. What that means is don't, good ads never look like ads, all right? So you wanna uh, consume, you wanna understand what's the culture inside Instagram Reels, what type of content people consume, the transitions, and then instead of just focusing on you know, your product, maybe show your product being used, right? And that's how you kind of capture, show a story about your product. Uh, by the way, if you want me, I know this video, we're talking about the tactics of the steps of placing the ad, but if you want me to make a separate video about uh, what's what's a good Instagram Reels ad, what type of video, and uh, maybe find some examples, let me know in the comments, because I can go do some research and then uh, uh, and create a video about creating good creative or videos for Instagram Reels ads. So anyway, so this is the placement you're gonna select and then hit next. Uh, right here, and then you're gonna go to the third step. Uh, this is where you will cre uh, create your ad. So I'm gonna say test, and let's select the, make sure you, you do have the right Facebook page and also the Instagram account selected. Uh, and then uh, right here is your ad setup. Uh, if you wanna use an existing post, you could do that. And then I'm gonna go, I don't, I don't believe this Instagram account has any vertical uh, videos, but let me just check. So select post, then we go to Instagram. So there's not like a good vertical video, 
so in this case, I won't do that. What I'll do is uh, create an ad and then I'll upload the video uh, from my computer. Or if you already have some vertical videos, uh, we don't have any for this account, so I'm not gonna select any right here. But this is how you can uh, add a video and then upload from your computer. Again, the thing I will remind you is make sure it's not an ad which is overly, you're selling too much, right? Because if it looks like an ad in Instagram Reels feed, guess what? People are gonna just swipe and then they're gonna go to the next piece of content. So make TikToks not ads. I'll say the same thing for Reels. Make Reels not ads. If you wanna make good, good ads are never ads, right? They, they tell a story, they show your product being used. But this is how you can create, you can run your ads on Instagram Reels placement using Facebook Ads Manager. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. Before you go subscribe, hit the bell icon and also like this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.